Hi, I'm Dave Epstein. Welcome to Growing Wisdom. And I'm going to give you a little bit of a tour of the fall garden. Mid-October, zone six, leaves on the ground. As we walk, you sort of notice, even as plants begin to go by, like the hydrangea there behind me has this great purple color. The sedums have the great burgundy color as well. You've also still got a lot of evergreens. We've got some Japanese holly, which is still in evergreen form. This is the bee balm, which has gone by now, of course. But still, I like the seed heads. They look sort of nice this time of the year. You've also got the bamboo back here which will stay green all year long. This is a clumping variety of bamboo. Again, some more Japanese holly. They're actually surrounding the hamamelis, which will bloom only in four months. I mean, here it's mid-October. This guy's going to be blooming by February. I can already see a few of the little buds on there as well. I've got an attempt at a wajilia being espaliered against the fence. Kind of a work in progress. And then we get to the chocolate eupatorium with its white, which is blooming. And if you're a regular watcher of the videos, you know how much I love white. And then finally, way in the back, is one of the last varieties of Simicifuga or Actaea. It has a great scent to it. I like the smell. Some people don't. This will bloom right up until we get a really hard frost or freeze. I've also got some Triceratus over here, another very late blooming plant here in the garden. And this will continue to go right up until the frost. And then there's even against the house, there's even a few last roses that are blooming. Those particular roses there, a knockout variety of rose. And you can see that those are still in bloom. So I want to show you one other thing that's blooming back here. It's called Monk's Hood. It has that great purple color with a little bit of white in it. So it's light. It shows up this time of the year. The thing that will stop this is not that it will end blooming, but in this zone, it's going to be the frost or the freeze. And the final thing I want to show you, we're going to walk over to an area where I've got some hardy chrysanthemums. And these particular chrysanthemums are not the chrysanthemums that you buy necessarily at the supermarket that you put out the mums, you know, they come in all those different colors. But these hardy chrysanthemums, this one's called Sheffield, continue to bloom again right until the end of the season and they'll get better and better and better as each year goes by. This is probably my favorite October flowering plant. Again, it will flower into November if we don't get too cold. So we've given you a little bit of a tour around the yard, kind of coming full circle. I feel like the season is coming to an end here in October. But the great thing is that in just a few more months, things will start blooming again. And next week, we'll have more videos for you here at Growing Wisdom.